This refers to what we heard today in the news, and uh, Prime Minister Netanyahu was very close. This was a meeting between Khaled Marshall from the Hamas and Abu Mazen from Patah. So no doubt that this combination of Hamas, who Marshall who a month ago said his intention is to wipe out Israel and coming now together with Abu Mazen is no doubt is a, a big threat to Israel. Now, what we see here, in fact, this is interesting, as we have these two names, it means really the surnames of, you see here, this is Marshall and Mazan. Now, what is interesting is that it appears here, once in the Torah, a Hamas, you can see here, a Hamas, a Patach, you see a Hamas, a Hamas, and this is once in the Torah, clear indication that there will be some connection between these two theories, apparently. And especially now, when this meeting came up, no doubt, as Prime Minister Netanyahu said, is a big threat and cannot, be, cannot do peace with such kind of people. Then, what we see it is also, as we said, always look on the location, the Torah. So the location is where the Torah tells us that you come to Israel and you find out your enemies. You see, your enemies are there. As we, today, unfortunately, in Israel, we have this Patach and Hamas. Now, also what is interesting is that when you have the Patach and Hamas, you have next to it, Em Oiva, they are, they are my enemies. It's you know quite well that the term Oivai refers, as Rabbi Nebuchadnezzar said to the Arabs, Ishmael. And in, for such a situation, there was one solution, definitely, to ask God to help us, to help us, kum Hashem be'afut so'ebecha. Ask God to get up, give you a call, and to cause our enemies to spread, and not to be united, definitely. So, a table which really fits with the news today, as we said, when these people, Marshall, Harvey Marshall and Mazen, met together, which also, by the way, comes under their names, M O Y, they are my enemies. So, no doubt that having these names and the Patach and the Hamas in this location, once in the Torah, as we said, is important teaching for us, that only by believing in Hashem, putting our security in God, confidence in God, He is the only one who can get up give a call and save us from these enemies which threaten to wipe out Hashem from Israel, as this Mishael said. So, the only way is keeping the Torah, doing what the Torah said, studying Torah, as it's written that this is the power of Israel, and only by this will be saved from all these problems, threads that we have today.